Hey guys, Jemmy God here, and today I'm going to be showing you the Jemmy Dancing Penguin, another vintage classic from the 90s, made around the same time that the uh, Dancing Christmas Teddy Bear I reviewed years ago, at this point, was made. I'd say about a year later at least, because uh, this was released in 1999, and the Teddy Bear was released in 1998. And, uh, funny story, um... The one you see in the box is not the one that I originally got. Um, the box you see him sitting in is from the first one I got. And uh, in that in the demo video that the seller featured with that one, it did work. But when it got into my hands, it didn't work like it should. And soon after that, it pretty much fried for no reason. Which actually gave me the opportunity... To uh, take that one's head bracket out, since it was perfectly intact, and put it in my disco dino. So now he works flawlessly, and hopefully he won't be running into uh, a head bracket issue anytime soon. So the one you see sitting in the uh, box now is actually a second one that I bought soon after that. And this one is actually, not to brag or anything, but this one is slightly more low-pitched than usual compared to all the others I've seen on YouTube. But, uh, yeah, this one didn't have any board issues, he works, um, didn't have to do a single thing to repair it, except give it a brand new set of three AA batteries, and that's it. So here's the box, it says, Dancing Penguin, I sing and dance to Sleigh Ride, try me, squeeze my hand, and there's the Duracell battery included sticker, that's still holding on, over 20 years later. North Pole Productions, Jemmy Industries Corp, Dancing Penguin, I sing and dance to Sleigh Ride, try me, squeeze my hand. Here's the back, it reads, Dancing Penguin, celebrate the holidays with this animated penguin. Squeeze his hand and he will warm your heart as he sings and dances to Sleigh Ride. He'll entertain you this Christmas. And I'm sure he has entertained many folks um, for the past um, several Christmases, even though his song is short but sweet. Three AA batteries. Sleigh Ride, music by Leroy Anderson, lyrics by Michelle Parrish, 1949-1950. And I have to say, if this song, Sleigh Ride, is not in the public domain now, it should be soon enough, because it's 1949, it's 2023, do the math. This song is almost 80 years old now. Jemmy Industries Corp, 1998, this is item number 13206. Here's the other side. It, it's weird to think that this is supposed to be part of the North Pole Productions line, because it's got more of a cartoony vibe to it, and most other... And most, if not all other North Pole production items I can think of, have a more realistic detail to them, so to speak. And here's the bottom of the box. Attention, includes three AA batteries for in-store demonstration purpose only. Jemmy Industries makes no guarantees to the demonstration battery life, and you know how the rest of the song goes. So yeah, and he even still has the uh, squeeze my hand tag still intact. And, um, it's the blue one with the yellow text. You will see this tag, um, the most commonly on this penguin character. And, um, you'll see it on some variants of the Sports Gorillas and Pizza Joe. So it's not just this guy that has this version of the Squeeze My Hand tag. But anyways, here he is in action. See? What did I tell you? Told you his song was short but sweet. And uh, if you're thinking just how big this guy is, he's about as big as you'd expect him to be. Not big at all. He's actually quite small. And now you'll also notice that the eyebrows are curved up, just like the singing bears. Um, again, a bit of an odd design choice, but uh, I'm not complaining by any means. And... Uh, you're not going to believe this until you actually dis, uh, disassemble one of these for yourselves, but the the yellows you see on the beak actually goes around the rest of the head. The only thing that's white on it is, well, the eye mask that's uh like the first surrounding. This is the only white part. Everything else on the head is yellow. And and no, it's not um brittle plastic. That's just how it's designed, thankfully. And there's the red and green striped scarf. The uh, top hat's a little uh messed up. Probably could... uh. Work on that. Here's the side of the penguin. Hmm. 
And my, uh, the first one I got that came with the original box was pretty much average pitched. It was, uh, pretty high pitched. Pretty much kind of like most of the other penguins I've seen on YouTube. So I'm glad I got, a uh, um, this one because, it's, uh, like I said, it's unusually low pitched as you know by now. There's the Jemmy Industries ink tag. Oh, this thing keeps falling over. Jemmy Industries Inc., Irving, Texas. Now, I'm not sure if there's a variant of this with the uh, older Jemmy tag. You know, the one with the Jemmy logo on it. I uh, wouldn't be so sure if there was one variant, but if uh, such a piece exists, that would be cool. All right, let's go ahead and play the penguin again. And that's pretty much it, guys. That's the uh, Dancing Penguin from 1998, made by the one and only Jemmy Industries Corporation. And again, I do find it kind of weird how this is part of the North Pole Productions line, um, speaking from a canon point of view, of course. But uh, hey, it is what it is. Another vintage classic from Jemmy Industries. Thanks for watching.